Today we're going to show you how to cook Adidas. And no, we're not talking about the sportswear brand. We're talking chicken feet. Usually, Filipinos like to cook Adidas in an adobo sauce, but today we'll be cooking them in a sauce that has more of a Chinese influence. For this recipe, we'll first need to prepare a pound to a pound and a half of chicken feet. Using a meat cleaver, chop off all of the tips of the fingers of the chicken feet so that the nails are completely removed. We found that spreading the actual fingers makes them a little easier to chop. Just be careful not to chop your own and take your time if you need to. Once you're done giving your chicken feet a manicure, place them into a pot. The purpose of this next step is to kind of cleanse the chicken feet of any impurities. Next, add in half a tablespoon of salt, one fourth cup of ginger, and just enough water to fully submerge all the ingredients. Afterwards, cover your pot and boil everything for 15 minutes. When it's done boiling, carefully remove just the chicken feet out of the pot. At this point, it's time to start cooking. In a new pot, first drop in one bunch of green onions, followed by one star anise, and three slices of ginger. Then place your chicken feet right on top. Next, pour in one third cup of soy sauce. 1 4th cup of sherry cooking wine, 1 4th cup of brown sugar, and 4 cups of chicken stock. Cover your pot and simmer for about 2 hours. Every 30 to 45 minutes or so, you'll want to give it a little stir and check to see that the sauce is thickening. In our case, we ended up just removing the lid an hour or so in just so we could thicken the sauce a little bit more. After it's done cooking, the chicken feet should have a nice brownish color to them from the sauce. If you've never eaten chicken feet before, at this point you might be thinking, how the heck do you eat these? Adidas can be eaten with white rice, but you can also just snack on them as is. What I like to do is just take one chicken foot and bite as many of the fingers off as I can, bone and all. Then what you want to do is try to suck all of the meat off the bones. It takes a little bit of practice, but once you have it down, you should be able to just spit out all the bones, leaving all the meat in your mouth to gobble up. My favorite part is the palm of the chicken foot, because it contains the most meat and is the easiest part to eat. All you have to do is bite it off. And that's how you eat chicken feet. It's talagang tasty, if you're into it. <laughs>